So, what should we do? What are the solutions to prevent your fire? For the third year running, Firefight Trust, in partnership with Conrad Odner Stiftung and government departments under the Ministry of Environment, Climate Change, Tourism and Hospitality, came together with communities to enhance the knowledge about how best to protect resources from damage or loss by fire. Since 2018, at the beginning of each peak fire season, this firefighting initiative is held in a selected community, which is selected in consultation with the Zim Parks, EMA, and Forestry Commission. The idea is to interact with communities living in close proximity with national parks and forests. Namslanje ni fundile ngogo ngogo tuicha umli lo. Yagambo ita misangani yakawanda wanda tisha baadhi ringa tu wazamu chenda pamsoro pe juuani kwa shudu shenyik. The 2020 edition was held in the Defe community of Gokwe during the COVID-19 lockdown. In compliance with the recommended health and safety measures, the event spaces were first sanitized, face masks were provided for everyone, regular hand sanitization was carried out, and the event was limited to a maximum of 50 people only. The Zimbabwe Republic Police were engaged to enforce social distancing and enhance awareness. Chirwere ichi, chirwere chisati chawaniru wa mushonga, nukwani saku chirapu. Ndoksa kamchuona nasi kanatao maka garapanapa. Manzi garai maka mendena inonzi social distance ye one meter. Because ndo the only solution ye kuzivirira kutekeshera kwe chirwere ichi. Chino tekeshera nenzira zakati one day. The training was held over a period of two days to allow for two different communities to attend in smaller groups as part of the social distancing measures. Chiri <laughs> my field fires. Tuna tayari kuti pano pati pano. Taka tare sana ne kana tiri page wone paka ino tichirisa. Muchirisa magatare sana paks mashinji. Mune atnoti yo little at human disturbance ya kanya ni sa because the protected area. Saka zaa ma protected areas edu ose amuna ku ku kanga ni swa kama sango kanya ni sa. Communities, Million dollars. 
Day two was held in a different area of the Defe Mutendi community, with another set of 50 members of the community attending. Unlike day one, day two saw more women attending. The program was carried out in an interactive and relaxed environment. <laughs> Tofana <laughs> And this is the the Tiru <laughs> Tinofana kuropai, pamwe chete, 
Kuitra uti wakaenda na bata hivi ya. Mungu na vita lenye makari bata kai. Zaka naka naka. Kilofana kusa kuit zaku dai maningi. Asikuti gadi vya apa. Tisina kufura. Ma food zedu. Tishirova. Ande tika. Tishirova. Do za kilofana kuita se. Za kilofana kuita. Panenga rimi raka kiri rama ningi. Tinenga tine chi. Tine matange mvura. Ya kana tine manevu sa kitengs. Ano tiba tira uti. Tonga ya mvura. Kana kuzo peze. Sava tinenga tazima. Pano sara vajifunga ira. Pane pane moto. Tinofana kusia njimbo. Isi sina variku funga ira. Tiru kuzo ane naka. Do za tine tifana kuita iso. Soka nasi tingura moto. Papati ni yeku chakwe moto ino itika mchirisa. Chakwe na wati mchirisa maganga mune muka. Sakaita sema sebo, maroni antilope, ne e bigger population ye ma buffaloes. Patinu kuda kwe moto, makaita change ye vegetation. Chakwe ita mabushi encroachments akawanda kuti. Chakwe wana kwa kuita miti, kudarika sora. Ne kutipa nocha pae pae pane shaka wanda shiru kuparazu wa pasi. Saka miti yedu, ndo ya kuwanda. Sora, richa wanikire kuti magrazers, muka zinofura sora. Ziwane cheku ujika chaka kwana. Zindru mungu wa kufara kuti, nemiwa makoko wa mga tenda kuhuya, kuti tizo batira na tizizi sani. Tigoeta akisungo kuti tichipa panu. Tata zizi suwa tafinzwa. Topa ta promisa tuweza miko zoguta atizipa mizi anditi. Yes, kana tisiri isu tine ama zedu kwa ziri koko Nesuo ngati fambisia ifangeri rachu Rukuti pasine moto Kana ndia zokera kumushao kukune wamo wa sina kuwea pano Wa sina kunge wako kwa opano Ndishano simbi sanyaye kuti kupisa moto Kuri more dangerous So kuti atifanu kuti tipise moto Pantumbo za tino gara No kuti zino konzeresa kuti Ti ziwani kwa zedu zino parara Saka tunofana uti tichenge teze, naraunda yedu, tichisa mafaya gadi. Kutila uti moto urega kungo parari ya posi posi na uti tichia so shai wa zunuza. Saka tunofana uti tira raminaso, pa naraunda yedu. Saka nichanyi ya kundo simbisa shoko iru oru kuti wanavazi yoti moto waka shata. Endo waka shatire ifutise. Good afternoon Mr. Kapesa and welcome to the show that talks about climate change and environment. And this afternoon we wanted to delve into the areas that you are charged with. You're the cluster manager for uh, Sebungwe area. Um, how do you feel about this new uh, approach where you have clusters in terms of national parks management? Thank you very much. Uh, I'm very much excited uh, about this cluster decision because uh, it has brought uh, the station closer so that they can easily be managed. For instance, my cluster office is based in Gokwe town which is closer to, Ch to Chirisa, which is closer to Sengwa, Seng 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 which is also closer to Chizarira, as well as Masala National Park. Those are the stations that I manage. Okay. They fall under four districts, which is Nyamiyami, Binga, Gokwe South and Gokwe North. Okay. So today we're talking about fire. Fire is a big problem in Zimbabwe and fire management. Um, what are your problem child uh, areas in, in your cluster that we're looking at? Yeah, yeah, we do have quite a number. All the parks are a, a, a challenge except for Chete, okay. Chete Safari area. We have got Ma Chizaria National Park, which has got a uh, few lot uh, in species like Hyperania species uh, and so mountainous, as well as uh, uh, Chirisa Safari, area, which is also closer to Chizaria. The land is almost the same okay. in terms of uh, you know uh, the biomass. So those are the problem areas that we have. Uh, in this cluster, Chirisa and Chizarira. As we shoot this program, we're actually in the area, Chirisa area, um, and there's a program that is taking place today, um, and the program is a, a fire training program, community fire drive. Um, I mean, look, these are issues that we're all looking at and saying, how do we help our community? How do you feel about uh, such a, um, a program? Definitely, this is a very positive initiative. Thank you very much. We are very much excited because, you know, for Chirisa, part of that area, it was excised. It was part of, uh, of, of uh, the Chirisa safari area and it was dis de degazetted 
for the settlement of uh, the community. So the coming in of this pro 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 program, you know, it is very positive in that uh, we are going to capacitate uh, the communities the best way how they can uh, live in harmony with uh, wildlife, the trees. You know, without such an leadership, definitely our 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 national park will be a threat because they they they, they, they are just settled, just look for the, for the national park, and we want that area that was given to them uh, so that they can look after that area in a positive way, environmental friendly. So definitely, we are very excited by this program. Okay, does the national park in your cluster have the capacity? to reduce the number of fires in this area. Of course, we know that your numbers are very high at the moment and you are coming in as a new manager. Obviously, that's probably one of your objectives to reduce the number. Do you have the sufficient capacity to reduce these incidents that are taking place in this area? And this new development you've talked about, having communities also um, opening up and living in the same area. Uh, uh, definitely, we don't have the capacity as national parks. You know, this, we, we, we need... Uh, partners whom we can partner with so that we can achieve this uh, uh, objective of uh, controlling fires. You know, it is uh, definitely a threat, not only here, also across the country, even globally. So we need uh, uh, non-government organization who come and assist parks so that we can manage and mitigate the fire threats in our parks. The two-day Sabukwe Cluster Community Fire Drive was attended by 100 people. 100 fire beaters were donated as well as a double-sided fire danger rating sign. The response from the community was overwhelming with people walking for distances as much as 13 kilometers to attend the event. Some people had to be turned away as part of adherence to stipulated health and safety measures. It is without doubt that the Defe community requires more training.